At first, caring for a preemie can be trying, both because you're short on sleep and you're worried about your baby's fragile status even though he's stronger than you think. In the beginning, especially, these tips can make preemie parenting a smoother ride. Learn to swaddle. If born full term, your preemie would have still been in the womb, which is why the security of the swaddle is even more important. Get help learning to swaddle your little one from the nurse before you leave the hospital and keep practicing until you can do it with your eyes closed. Though preemies still don't snooze as deeply, swaddling does help. Don't feel badly about waking him up. They say you should never wake a sleeping baby, but when it comes to preemies, it can be a must because they're likely to sleep through feedings if you don't. Many preterm babies don't start off breastfeeding for a variety of reasons, but once they start, it can be hard to keep them awake during a session. If your little one falls asleep constantly during feedings, try burping her, switching positions, singing a vibrant song, rubbing his forehead with a cool towel or changing the scenery. Set ground rules when it comes to visitors. Family members eager to meet your baby may not understand that preemies are more prone to illness, so you'll have to be firm about telling them that your baby isn't ready to be passed around, but reassure them that the day will come. Always on the side of caution. Postpone visits from anyone with a cold especially curious preschoolers or toddlers, and of course, no smoking around your baby is a no-brainer. Get the support you need. Keep in touch with other preemie parents who are at the hospital with you after you leave the NICU. You'll be amazed at how much extra time you have to text when you're burning the midnight oil breastfeeding your sleepy preemie. Additionally, take a parenting class at the hospital to get support from others who know what you're going through. If you think you have postpartum depression, be sure to tell your doctor immediately so you can get the help you need. Hormone fluctuations post-pregnancy are normal, but those coupled with the lack of sleep and the anxiety of caring for your teeny baby can sometimes feel like too much. It's normal to have some less-than-perfect moments with your premature baby, especially in the early days as you get the hang of caring for him without the security of neonatal physicians and nurses nearby. With each day, though, you'll get a little more confident, your baby will become better at communicating his needs, and you'll find your rhythm, just like any other parent-baby team. And the good news, most preemies catch up completely by the time they're toddlers. Your little one likely won't be little for long. One thing you're likely already aware of is how different your baby is compared with full-term newborns. It's normal to be nervous, but there are ways to simplify the transition from hospital to home sweet home and make caring for your preemie as stressless as possible. You got this.